Welcome to Derek Love Shopping. I am your host, Derek Fabulous. And speaking of fabulous, I'm in love, love, love with my jewelry. And today I'm with my very dear friend, Kara Ross, in her Upper East Side studio where we're gonna look at her 2010 collection. So come with me. Kara Ross. Hello, my darling. How are you? I'm so happy you're here. Thank you for having us. It's such a joy. I love coming to this studio because everything is Derek Fabulous. (laughs) Now, tell me how you get started. When I was about 13, my mom and dad took my sister and I to uh, Kenya in Africa, and they let us pick some stones. We each picked two stones. I picked two emerald cut green tourmaline. My sister chose uh, two garnets. And then when we got back to Philadelphia, where I'm from, we went down to Jewelers Row and we were able to design a piece of jewelry and uh, turn it into something. And I used those two emerald cuts to create a, a beautiful ring. And it was 18 karat gold with two green tourmalines with two diamonds in the middle. And I still have it today. And so I think that was a, a really early lesson uh, that you can create something from, from really, from nothing. So when did you start Kara Ross, New York? About six years ago, I uh, came up with the collection. It was primarily rock crystal quartz, gold, and diamond accents, and I put it into uh, Bergdorf Goodman. It's really coming from the inherent beauty and in the shape of the stones or the materials or the exotic skins that the bags are made from. I love this necklace. <laughs> Derek is my unofficial male model and muse. And you can see that this piece is Python. Um, and on a beautiful chain, we also do an indiv- a longer chain with one single piece. This is a beautiful vintage chain with tiger's eye and turquoise as the eyes of the snake. This is a piece that I'm wearing. Um, This is a cuff bracelet with red python and tiger's eye. And for instance, the earrings that I'm wearing now are a lapis, a sugar loaf um, cut lapis stone. So again, again, for me, the, the thing that differentiates my line from others that are out there is that having the history as a gemologist and in right. love of jewelry, I incorporate the real gemstones in the jewelry. And now tell me like retail on like the earrings. The earrings would run about um, uh, 175 retail. I have cuff bracelets that run anywhere from 150 to $400 retail. These pieces are special. I never do large production runs. They're very, at the most, maybe I'll make 50 of these. So. It, the collection right. is small, it's niche, and you won't see yourself coming and going, which I think is very important. What are three Kara Ross must-haves that every woman should own? I would say one will be a clutch. I think the clutches are made of beautiful, beautiful skins, exotic skins, and most have a gemstone element. Number two would be a cuff bracelet. They can totally transform an outfit. They have real gemstones and exotic skins. They're fun, they're playful, and affordable. And number three, I would say a long pendant necklace. It goes with everything can really transform an outfit. You can also change it and wear it almost as a scarf pendant if you want to wear it short. So it has a lot, you could even wear it as a belt if you'd like. So many different uh, aspects of it. Kara, thank you so much for having us today. I love your work. It's so special. You really understand who you're designing for. And I just love the organic part of it. And you're really, your knowledge of what you're doing. It's just really amazing. Oh, thanks for coming, Derek. Oh, of course, my great. pleasure. So fun. For more information on Kara Ross, you can go to her website at www.kararossny.com and there's a list of retailers worldwide. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you again, my darling. You're and remember everyone, have a Derek fabulous day. Bye.